We all know that successful mathematics learning requires students to learn three things. They need to learn the content. They need to learn what mathematics is all about. If they learn that mathematics is thinking, mathematics is figuring out, then they have a higher chance to perform at a, a high level. The third thing they need to learn is who they are as a learner. What I want to do for you today is just share with you a bit of a, a real life story and a real life journey. What do Ofsted want? What do they see maths as? And what are Ofsted looking for? Talk to the inspectors about what a lesson will look like because that's often what the barrier is. What we had been doing wasn't the right thing and this was the way we should be teaching. Keeping those children together but starting with that problem solving whole class approach. What happens in the classroom? How do you get those kids ready? So we spend the first part of year one looking at learning behaviours. For example, how do you move from the carpet to sitting at tables, which is often something that they find a challenge. Um, what we have found is the knock-on effect is as, as the maths has improved, the reading has got better as well. The children are independently able to read far more. We worked with seven uh, volunteers and they uh, became teacher researchers. The, the teachers were very sceptical of the textbook, so was I to be honest at the start of this project. They, they, they were wary of it and it was only after a year or even into the second year that they began to say, actually I see now how they're designed. This idea that actually teachers need to create a classroom culture where children are becoming thinkers and they're the ones who are judging each other's ideas rather than the teacher being the one who stands at the front saying, right, yeah, that's the right one, excellent, let's all do that one. The great thing was that we got this very clear message from teachers. They were becoming mathematicians. They were feeling more confident, more excited about maths, more um, empowered about maths. And that then was reflected in the children. 